Hi everyone, I'm Bertie with BIM Lounge. In this quick video, I'll show you how to create your InfraWorks model and to get it to show the maximum resolution for the ground imagery. Let me show you. First, in case you've never created an InfraWorks model, let me show you how to create one in just a few seconds. Now you want to start by clicking on Model Builder and from there you can navigate or search for your location. And I would recommend switching to the aerial view and then go ahead and frame your view. Now at this point, just give this project a name. Now keep in mind this may take a few minutes depending on the extent of your model. Now once your project is done, you'll see it appear in this list and you can uh, open it by clicking on it. The first thing you wanna do when you first open a InfraWorks model is to head over to Model model properties and make sure that the correct coordinate system is set. In my case, since I know I'll be using Google imagery in the future, I want to set it up to this, which I know is compatible in my case, and I'm going to click apply. Now, of course, a problem that we see is that the resolution of the imagery is not adequate. So let's go ahead and um, double click on imagery in the data sources and under raster you see that we're at tile level 17 which corresponds to the resolution and we can bump it up to 19 and that helps a lot let's try that close and refresh and this may take a moment now when the imagery is downloading you'll see the big difference here you see in plan this is a lot easier to work with. And also if you use this for visualization purposes, this is not the right resolution that you want in your context. Now, if you can't really visualize the difference, let me show you what the previous one looked like. So you can tell almost side by side. And this is what it looked like before. So before and after, this is way better. However, you see that obviously this is not perfect, but it's workable. You can stop right here if you'd like to, but I'm not satisfied personally. Some of these areas are blown out. You know, you don't really have enough details. So what I did was I imported a image from Google Earth. And although the resolution is not much higher, you can tell that there's much more detail the, these areas are not blown out, so you can still use them to get points and references. And overall, the, the image is sharper. So I would recommend using your own custom imagery. Now in the next video, I'll show you to do just that. Get imagery from services like Google Earth, georeference it in AutoCAD, for example, and then bring it in InfoWorks to improve your site plan or visualization.